So when it comes to the police, they're not your friend. Like I know that they're meant to protect us, but it's important to remember that they're also there to prosecute us. And what I wanted to show you today was this tweet here from Merseyside Police. As you can see right there, it got quite a lot of views on Twitter. That is 6.9 million people. And there's a bit that's blurred out that we're going to get onto in a moment. But it says that there was a man that was arrested as he stepped off the plane after his holiday for his involvement in the disorder in Southport. So basically they've arrested this guy, arrest number 70, for the situation that we saw in Southport. But underneath that blurred bit, I'm not going to show what it says, albeit the Merseyside police will, because it says the guy's full name, and then it says his street name as well. I've left out the bit where it says street, but like the whole thing is there, just completely telling the world the guy's name and his location. Well, maybe not his location now because he's been jailed for 20 months, but you know what I'm saying. Like there's going to be family members there and things like that, but to just put that on a tweet that's going to get seen by almost 7 million people. The guy's full name and the street address as well, minus the house number. I don't know. To me, that just sounds absolutely ridiculous. But let me know what you think in the comments. Is it okay to just put people's names and addresses out there? Or like myself, do you think that this just goes a bit too far? And don't forget to check out this video, where the government will pay you benefits for having multiple wives. It sounds crazy, having more than one. But, I mean, apparently the government's going to give you some money for it. And thank you for becoming one of the 47,211 subscribers. This country has gone crazy.